What's up, Trumbo and Plan friends? This is going to be a tutorial on rising rhythms. When you drop into the 10.7 video reply page for this song, you will see that you have the sheet music here in front of you. Be sure to click on your trombone sheet music, and then when you come over here, resize it so you can see it nice and big. How do we count this? The first thing we do in every song is make sure we know how it's going to sound rhythmically. Let's use our new counting system. Ready, go. One, two, three, four, one. Rest, rest. One, two, three, four, one. Rest, rest, rest. One, two, three, four, one. Rest, three, rest. One, two, three, four, one. Rest, rest, rest. Okay, if you did that perfectly with me, great. If you did not, go back and do that a few times with me until it's perfect, at least once or twice. <clears throat> going forward, we're now going to talk about what letters we're going to be reading in this song. Do you remember what letters you've been playing so far? What's this one? D, good work. How about this one? E flat. And y'all, all these E's are going to be E flats accidentals, which is this little B thingy. That is an accidental that carries through the measure. It's a rule in music. So all of these E's will all be E flats. They'll all be third position. How about these notes? F, good. And then how about this one? D, back to D at the beginning. Great. So now what we're going to do is go through some positions. Do you remember how to do the slide position for D? Fourth position. It's about there, somewhere in there. Do you remember how to do E flats? Third position, right about here. Yep. And then how do we do Fs? All the way in, first position. And then how about the last note of the song? All the way out to E, correct. Or D, sorry, <laughs> D, fourth position. Great. Now we're going to airplay using our newly found, newly acquired articulation skill. Put the trombone up to your face and try this with me on air. It's going to sound like this. Be sure to take a big breath. Be sure to get that separation between the notes. Remember, we're articulating up here. We want to make sure that tongue is firing to the roof of our mouth. Let's do the entire song from beginning to end. If you're not ready to do this, pause the video and, and come back and, and see the video when you uh, understand the slide positions really good and you don't have to think. But here's the slide and air play through. One, two, ready. Rest, rest. Rest. Rest, 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 rest. Good, good work. So if you did all that and you feel great about it, then let's move on to the playing part. When you go to play these, you may have to stop and practice a few times to make sure you're making the right sounds and nothing's going weird for you. But generally, it should sound like this from beginning to end, as long as you engage those lips and get that tongue firing in one smooth motion for these uh, multiple quarter notes in a row. Here's the whole song from top to bottom. Listen to how I play it and then try to copy me in the video reply. One, two, ready. <laughs> That may be a lot for you. Some of that may be too hard to do in one take. That means you need to practice. Guys, gals, you have to practice your instrument in order to get better at it. You can't try this one time and hope that Jesus takes the wheel and that it's all perfect the first time. 
No one in the history of learning instruments has been able to do that, okay? I can guarantee you that. There's a process to this. It's a slow one at first. And the more you practice, the better you get at practicing. And the better you get at practicing, the less you have to do it, okay? I'm not kidding. Like, I'm an old guy now. I don't have to practice this stuff as much. You'll eventually get there too, okay? So take your time with this. Spend time with it. Make it work. Don't cut corners and rinse and repeat anything that you need to hear again. Rewind the video as much as needed. I'm proud of you. Uh, this doesn't come easy, but in the end, this is kind of one of the harder songs at first, and then it'll kind of get easier for a while. Um, a lot of the songs only progress by one note harder or by one little snippet harder. So this is a lot. Tonguing, doing chord notes, um, changing pitches. It, this is kind of tough. You're the best. Um, keep up the good work. Let me know if you need help in office hours or in uh, our live sessions, and I'll be happy to spend time with you and get this worked out if you spend lots of time on this and just can't make it work. All right, guys. See you in the next one. Bye-bye.